Officials at the Vatican say Pope Francis's trip to Iraq was, quote, an important step in promoting fraternity. The Holy See's Higher Committee of Human Fraternity says the recently completed trip promoted tolerance and inclusiveness worldwide, not just in Iraq. The group says it is preparing a study on the results of the visit. Joining us now from Rome is Cardinal Fernando Filoni, who accompanied Pope Francis to Iraq. He is also the Grandmaster of the Equestrian Order of the Holy Sepulchre. Your Eminence, welcome. Thank you so much for your time today. So tell us, what were the highlights of the trip for you? And also, how do you think Pope Francis was received in Iraq? Well, I thank you, first of all, for inviting me. I... Uh, mm, can tell you immediately that uh, the first thing uh, I understood, it was very good for the people in Iraq, was the solidarity which the Holy Father uh, brought to them. It's uh, not simply question. Solidarity in a moment so difficult for uh, Iraqi people, for our Christians, for the uh, civil uh, society, is the most important in this moment. And uh, I think it was well accepted, well received. The enthusiasm was so high. And uh, I can tell you uh, the visit from this point of view was a success. And I am sure also the message the Holy Father gave to them, brought to them, will be understood, digested slowly, and uh, will influence the present and uh, the future of uh, this society. I know that you worked in Iraq for many years. Uh, uh, tell us, how has the country changed since you left, and how is it doing now? Although the situation is very complex and the interests are so many, I have to say that uh, uh, Iraq and the society in Iraq must grow to find uh, a way to unite itself. Iraq never, in its uh, hundred year, years of history, uh, was a united nation, was uh, something united from the deep. It was uh, just a province in the uh, Ottoman Empire. Today, we have uh, so many tribes, groups, religious. So, mix all of them together, and looking forward to the future, how do you see the future for Christians in Iraq? Well, uh, the Christian community is uh, half uh, from the time when I was there. Many uh, left uh, uh, because the last uh, uh, conflict, but uh, Others left Iraq uh, immediately after uh, uh, Saddam Hussein ended. But I have to say that the migration started at least in 40 years, when the work and uh, more the wars with uh, um, Iran, the war with Kuwait, the war between uh, uh, Saddam and uh, the Kurds left so many people uh, dead, wounded, with deep uh, scars. So in this uh, complicated moment in which uh, they now are, if there is a peace, if you find the possibility of security, I, th I think uh, uh, dialogue will flourish. Well, Your Eminence, thank you so much for your time today. It's been an honor. Thank you.